Hello everyone and welcome in this video about character creation. So I want to focus on the workflow of character creation. So I did in my YouTube channel a video about character artist, but now I want to focus on one workflow I personally use to create a character. I'm gonna have a little quick video about the whole process in my course and my store, but I just want in this video to talk to you about the whole workflow, all the process and all the pipeline you can use at your place to have a very good and solid character for 3D animation or for cinema, okay? So first of all, you have many, many options you can use to have a base mesh. So the base mesh is gonna be the first skeleton, the first mesh of your character. You want something clean, you want something with good topology, good proportion, and maybe you did once this for a project, but at some point and in production, you have to have tools to be able to manage and generate characters. So one of the first tools I really recommend is called MakeHuman. Really, really, really good software, MakeHuman. And you can go on makehumancommunity.org. They have some stable release and you can create, generate a lot of type of character. I'm gonna have a quick review of this on one of my courses. It's gonna be for free. The link on my store on the link of the video. And this is gonna be a very, very nice how to create a character from scratch using MakeHuman as a base and after going through a process of Maya, ZBrush and Substance Painter. So those three software is gonna be used on this video and that's also my personal process to create a character. You can create fully characters using Maya, fully character using Blender or even on Mudbox or just on ZBrush if you don't looking for animation but I want to have like a general common pipeline you can use, something you get used to use, and you can be ready for production, you can be ready to jump in a studio and create your own characters. So have a look at this video, that's a really, really good one. MakeHuman is a really, really good tool. When you jump into Maya, you can export everything you need in the old object, all the size, all the conventional format, and from that you can switch into ZBrush, do the maps, do the sculpting, back into Maya, export the UVs, go into Substance Painter, and from Painter, you can also switch back to Maya, generate the textures, maybe back to ZBrush to form adjustments, finish in Maya, use your favorite renderer. On my video is gonna be about Arnold, and Arnold is based now in Maya, so that's a good in, in package, and you're gonna have recognize lot of attributes from like other type of renderer. So Arnold is a solid one. And from here, you're gonna create your full character. So have a look at the link below. There is the link for this course and enjoy the Make Human and this overall process. Thanks for watching. Also stay tuned, there is a new webinar when I'm gonna create a character from scratch. And we're gonna do this the 7th of November, 2022 for this video. And I'm gonna try to do this every single Monday. So there is a webinar gonna start next week and I'm gonna make sure you have the overall process I'm putting on this video on live how to use it and with some Q&A, some question and you know, spend some time together to explain a bit more the process of character creation. Thanks for watching.